Hey everybody, this is Ted Check, recovering reporter. Here's something crazy. Here I am on the on the other side of the video. Usually I'm over here, but I didn't want to superimpose myself. That is really really weird. So I'm going to go over on this side. So today is day five of uh, 100 minutes, 100 for 100 days. Uh, this is Alex Hormozzi's challenge, and uh, so my focus is promoting my book, having a successful promotion, a successful marketing campaign for my upcoming book called Saving the Beast. And uh, so today what I did, um, well, I uh, first of all, uh, produced this video right here about uh, this guy. That's um, Paul Walter Hauser, who is an accomplished Hollywood actor, uh, but he got into pro wrestling. And um, so I used something. Here we can see. Uh, oh, I can't move it. All right. Never mind that. But anyway, you, you get the point. Uh, this is called Book Brush. It's a program that I learned about because I was, uh, or through through my uh, research on how to promote books, I found this uh, this website called bookbrush.com. It allows you to create um, all of your templates, all of your banners, and all of your promotional pieces, you know, graphics, um, and you can you can say yeah I want to do it for YouTube yeah I want to do it for you don't have to say yeah but I want to do it for YouTube I want to do it for Facebook I want to do it for X and it'll do it for you so this one right here I took uh, the photo from that video and then I just simply added this this part right here very simple um, it's it's gonna I'm I'm still working with it but it's gonna be a little, little more complex for my stuff related to the book but anyway that's one of the things I did today. Uh, also, my first email to the launch team, that was another thing I did today. So I have a launch team I'm getting together, and these people are going to, uh, you know, uh, hopefully, they're going to write reviews for me, because uh, that's my understanding that, uh, you know, if you get a, a good amount of reviews going, that uh, that the Amazon gods will smile down upon you. Uh, so, you, But you've got to do that. On the day that the book is released it's very important that you do that quickly so I'm gathering together all sorts of people that I know close personal friends of mine and otherwise uh, <laughs> so that um, we can have a good uh, a good launch day that's another thing so uh, and then beyond that I've been um, also uh, let's see figuring out who I'm going to send the book to because I'm going to get some some hard copies at some point and I'm going to send the book out to some you know I don't know if you want to call them very important people people that have uh, big followings that, that have podcasts that have TV shows things like that um, people at the top of the media heap and why not you know, a wing and a prayer. I'm going to send it, send it out to them. I'm going to give them a free copy and a handwritten note. And going to say, hey, look, this is something that I, that I feel is important. And I think your viewership or your readership will find important. So why don't you have me on your show? Why not? And uh, yeah, so so I'm going to go for it. You know, you, you have to. What I found with, uh, with book promotion is there's so many things. And there's so many things I'd like to accomplish with it. So many, so many avenues I'd like to go down, and I'm gonna go down as many as I possibly can, as best as I can. And so it's, I think it's important to have stuff on the on the ground level, the you know the and the and the low hanging fruit, so to speak. And then you got to reach for the moon, reach for the stars. Um, isn't that what Casey Kasem used to say? Keep your feet on the ground and keep reaching for the stars. Oh yeah. Uh, <laughs> anyway. So you know what I mean? You you gotta you gotta just take that risk, take that chance. Why not? Um, and who knows? Maybe maybe some of it uh, will come to fruition. We'll just have to see. But yeah, this is this is day five. If I hadn't uh, haven't said that already, day five of a hundred minutes for a hundred days. It's a challenge that Alex Hermosi came up with. And um, yeah, I'd say I'd say it's going pretty well. Uh, you know, so far. I, uh, you know, I, I feel dedicated. I feel like it's becoming a habit, you know, because I've, I've been doing it uh, for five days straight, actually more than that, but that I've been chronicling 
here on YouTube. I've been doing it for five, for five, 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 for five days straight. So uh, yeah, it feels pretty natural. It feels pretty organic. And uh, yeah, so there you go. Day five in the books. If any of you out there are doing the 100-100 uh, or 100 minutes for 100 days challenge, if any of you are doing it, if you've done it, drop me a comment. Let me know how it worked out for you or how it's working out for you so far. And uh, yeah, it'd be, uh, be great to, uh, to compare notes. So let me know your thoughts and I will talk to you later.